We find ourselves in a world in which death is viewed as a kind of emergency. Uh, those who are approaching death are often sent to the hospital, find themselves in emergency rooms, in intensive care, uh, and many in our society die there. This is very different than what we would find in the teachings of Jewish tradition. First of all, if we go back to the Bible and look at biblical models, someone approaching death anticipated that death. They would call their loved ones in, they would bless them, and they would look forward to the end, at least the temporary end, of their life in this world. Uh, if we go ahead to the later teachings of the Jewish tradition, the rabbinic tradition, we find that death is not, as in our world, a moment, the end of life, but rather death is a life stage, uh, something that we decline into, often slowly, but certainly with preparation, that there comes a moment of transition from life to death, but in the belief of our ancestors, death too was a life stage. This is all very important because whether we believe as our ancestors believed, the fact is that death is a life stage. It's something that we will all, every single one of us, experience. There's nothing at all unnatural about it. Uh, there might be emergencies that would allow us to be brought back to life if we get proper intervention. But at some point in all of our lives, there will come a time when death will be what comes at the end. So if we learn from Jewish tradition and understand that death is not an emergency, not necessarily a time to pull in all the forces and to fight as hard as we can, but rather a natural stage of all of our lives, an occasion when we can bring our family together and maximize our comfort, minimize our discomfort, that's what palliative care does. And if in the end we find ourselves with our loved ones, exchanging expressions of love, exchanging blessings, and then ease into that moment of death, we'll find ourselves not only more traditional, but we will find ourselves that much healthier as a society in recognizing that there is birth, there is living to its fullest, and part of living to its fullest means addressing the moment of death with a large embrace and with blessing.